that little handsome boy in the corner? Not interested. Hi guys, welcome back to another video. How do you film anymore? I don't know. I thought I'd pick up my camera for the first time. Actually, we're gonna pop you down here. I thought I'd film for the first time in a little while. This feels bizarre. I honestly feel so weird in front of a camera. I was actually on annual leave this week, so I've been off all week. It's now Friday and I have been moving into my new house. So this is my new house, this is my kitchen, this is my puppy, you'll have seen him before, pet, 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 there we go. What are you doing? So I thought I would just, you know, say say hello, just give you a quick update. I, I moved into my house last night, I the first night here with Casper last night and it went well. He was a little bit restless to start with. It took him about an hour to get to sleep, he was like crying and things, but he got used to it. If I pop out for like five minutes, I can hear him crying, but he'll get used to it, it's okay. It's just new surroundings for him, just like me, I'm getting used to it as well, getting used to where things are. This is actually the first time I've lived on my own before. I've lived, I've moved out before, but I've not lived on my own before. So getting used to that sort of stuff, things I didn't used to maybe do, I now have to do because I'm the only person here. But yeah, literally the whole week has been sort of moving myself in, getting everything ready for me to move in. So I'm here. If I sound a bit nasally, it's because hay fever is killing me today. I've had mascara all down my face already today. As soon as I step outside, my eyes stream. It's always around this time of the year where I, my hay fever is the worst. Wait, sneeze. Yeah, we're, oh my god, not a fan. Right, I need to get hay fever tablets. But yeah, today is just going to be quite a chill one. I'm going to spend the day with puppy, get him used to the house, let him have a roam about. Um, I'll probably nip to the shops at some point, but that's not exciting, I don't you know about that. Obviously now I'm living on my own, I'll have a little support bubble, so my family are my support bubble, so they'll be coming around tonight. I'll probably go to theirs for tea tonight, um, and give Casper some time to just get used to the place on his own. And then we'll pop back to my house for a glass of Prosecco in the evening, I think. So that's nice. But yeah, I thought I'd, you know, I thought I'd pick up the camera because there's a few things going on this weekend which I thought would be nice to film. Because of lockdown, not much has happened recently, but there is things happening. I moved into my house today. I'm gonna have a like Japanese night tomorrow, and then Sunday's Mother's Day. So I planned a an afternoon tea sort of grazing, mezzy platter board thing, maybe some cocktails and things like that. So I thought it'd be a nice time to nice time to pick up pick up my camera again and get back into the swing of things. I'm not going to show you around the house. Once When I'm filming bits and bobs, you'll see bits and bobs of the house, obviously, but I'm not going to film it quite yet because I've got some things I'm still waiting on. I'm still waiting on my bed frame, bedside tables. A couple doors are still not in place. Things like that, that I'm just waiting until they're completely done and finished so I can show you the full house tour. But I'm very excited to show you because I love it. I'm very happy with it and yeah, so that's, that's it. That's my little update for now, but I will catch you guys later. Yesterday it was a pretty chill day, went on lots of walks with Casper. Yeah, I'm currently on my floor on a mattress. Still waiting for my bed frame to come. My dog has definitely licked my camera because it is filthy. I hope that's better. Yesterday I had a little bit of a Japanese night, an Asian night. I had like sushi and I made okonomiyaki, um, which is like a Japanese savoury pancake. Uh, with like cabbage and mayonnaise and like a special okonomiyaki sauce, which I made from scratch. I'm saying made from scratch, it's literally ketchup, oyster sauce and Worcestershire sauce um, mixed together, but it's so good. I had like hockey and mochi, you know, just, just something to do on a, Sunday, a Saturday night, um, a little bit different um, because there's not much else we can do at the moment. So I thought, why not have a little, a little themed night, which was really nice. Just, today is Mother's Day, so I'm going to go and head over to my family, who are my bubble and have a little like afternoon mezzy grazing platter thing for my mum. My sister won't be there this year because she's working. We do it every year so I quite enjoy it. It's quite a nice little excuse to eat 
eat lots of good food. So that's that, but I'll show you that at the time. Casper's away for the next couple of nights, so I can get this place looking tidy because I swear he comes in for 15 minutes and my house is a mess. Ripped toys everywhere, hair everywhere. He's a messy dog, but he's so cute. <laughs> On Friday, I think, I don't know if I updated you on what happened on Friday. So I had a little, I had my family round for Prosecco and we had some red velvet cake, which is so good. If you ever get the chance to eat the red velvet cake from Costco, it is divine. So you should have that at some point because it's so good. But yeah, I had Prosecco, oh, had some nice gifts from them for moving in, like plants and flowers and cards, which is all really lovely. Just, yeah, just had, just had a few glasses of Prosecco in my new house. It's sort of like my housewarming party, I suppose, because I can't have an actual party with my friends. <laughs> it was nice and chill, but yeah, I better go and head over. Um, but I'll probably show you little clips and things of the day as well, so yeah, let's do that. It's now Thursday. I'll have last left you on Sunday, which was Mother's Day, which you'll have seen my little afternoon tea. It just ended up being me and my mum. My sister's living elsewhere at the moment and my dad was golfing. So it was just the two of us, but that was quite nice. Which meant more food for us and it just, it was good. The food was lovely, the cakes were lovely. Divine, I was eating cakes for days after. Can't complain. Yeah, today, it's almost the end of the week. It's almost Friday, we're on Thursday. I'm just finished work for the day and I'm away to meet Holly. We're gonna go for a walk down to Costa, pick up a coffee and walk back and just sit in my garden for a little bit. Cause it's actually somewhat of a nice day today. The sun's out, so I'll take out a few chairs and we can just sit and chill in the garden. Walk Casper at the same time. I'll just have a chit chat, you know? I just thought I'd pick up my camera because when do we do things these days? So it, I just, you know, I had to make this moment. I had to document this moment. I just had to document it. That's what we're doing. <laughs> My eyebrows need seriously taming. But we're just gonna excuse that. And yeah, I think I'm gonna leave this vlog here, guys. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. Please bear with me while I'm getting back into the swing of things because it's... Speaking to a camera when you've not done it for a while is very bizarre, so there's that. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna love you and leave you. Uh, make sure you like, subscribe, comment and all that jazz and I'll see you in the next one. Bye! Are you up on mum's sofa? Are you meant to be up on mum's sofa right now? I don't think so. I don't think so.